Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Recently I found out that Disney has been making ice cream bars just like that are sold at Disney World and Disneyland and they are available in your grocery store. Now I had a hard time finding these, but I did find them at Target. I did go to a Target yesterday since I have bought these and they didn't have any. Um, these are a limited edition or not a limited, yeah, they are limited edition, it even says so. Um, but they're they're out for just a short amount of time to celebrate Mickey's 90th birthday and so I thought I would get some and test them out and see what they taste like now the disadvantage for me is that I've never actually had one from Disneyland or Disney World so I really don't have the comparison all I can do is tell you if it's good or not and that's kind of the sad news but uh, the good news is it's shaped like a Mickey so uh, let's open it up and see what it is all about. Now I will say these are low fat um, Mickey Mouse bars. They, you get six bars. I believe they retailed for $6.99, so a little over a dollar per ice cream bar. Uh, my understanding though is that they are smaller than what you would get at Disneyland or Disney World. So let's open this up and check it out. Now, I will say that they are just in a, a white sleeve. There's no, you know, there's no wording or anything. I know the ones in the parks are uh, have nice designs on them and are colorful. These are not, but it, I guess it really doesn't matter. It's the ice cream that we're looking at right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this aside and let's see how this is. Now hopefully it's not all broken or anything. So these are made by Nestle's dryers. Um, I don't know if the original ones, that's who makes them or if they have another source or not. But like I said, we're just gonna take them for what they are and see how they taste. Now, now for the unveiling. Man, these are small. <laughs> these are really small, but they're pretty cool. I do, I would say they're pretty cool. So now for the taste test. Now again, like I said, I have nothing to compare them to. That's the sad news, but I'll tell you whether they're good or not. Okay, they're very good. I think, and the chocolate seems to be fairly thick. You can see right there, the ice cream. I don't know why I'm shaking, but the ice cream is, uh, it's very good, they're very good. And like I said, I don't know what to compare it to because I haven't had the other ones, but at least you can have Mickey Mouse at home and pretend that you're in the happiest place on earth at your house. So I'm gonna continue eating this and uh, keep you posted. They're really good. Really, really good. They're definitely worth the money. So what I would say is if you're interested in getting these, um, I did get mine at Target. Um, I know other stores are supposed to carry them, but um, that's one of the nationwide stores that I'm aware of. Anyway, they were not by the ice cream. You'd think they'd put them right by the ice cream. This was in its own little end freezer. Um, and I know other people that have found them have also found them in odd places. So you got to kind of look around in all the freezers and see if you can find these. Like I said, yesterday I went and looked for some more. They did not have any. And I'm concerned that even the target that I got them at, that they might not get any more, that that may be it. I probably should have bought the other box knowing how good these are, but I did not. So I would recommend checking them out get some i think you'll like them you know i think you take them for what they are but they're really good i'm i'm quite impressed with these so with that note i'm gonna finish my chocolate bar ice cream bar and we'll see you next time guys bye